Hello again, everybody. It's been a while now, hasn't it? Almost a whole month. It's a long time. I hope you're all doing well and settling into a new routine, finding new work. Today's a weird day. It's Palm Sunday. It's just about Easter, just around the corner. And I'm not sure if you remember, but Palm Sunday is one of those Sundays where we have a big party and a big celebration and all the palms come out and we say, glory to God in the highest. And blessed is he in the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Remembering how Jesus comes into Jerusalem to meet us in a new way. But it doesn't stop there on that day. We also remember that this is Holy Week. And this is the week where Jesus and his disciples had their last supper. What? Where Jesus washes his disciples' feet, where he's arrested, tried, and crucified. So even as we're having the big Palm party, we know too that there's something really kind of dark and kind of weird going on too. I think we see this in our lives a lot. When I was a kid, and I'm guessing you get this a lot too, I heard a lot of, well, all that is fine and fun and good, but we just wait until you put somebody's eye out with that then that won't be fun at all. Now, rarely did that actually happen, and it's just one of those weird things that we adults say, but the point is always the same. It's all fun until something else happens. Because life is like that. There's good and there's bad all together. Just in this time where things have been challenging, really challenging, and maybe even a little bit scary. But also if you've been looking around and listening to your family and to your friends and to your neighbors, you've also seen some really cool stuff. People helping each other, looking after each other, doing things differently. If we want to see God at work, we need to look at the both ends. We need to see the bad for what it is, but we also need to see what happens in the midst of the bad, in the midst of the hard. Like Mr. Rogers used to say, always look for those who are helping. I like Mr. Rogers a lot. He's a hero of mine. Look for those who are helping. And even as we go through this week with Jesus, we can look towards the way that Jesus came and was true and trusted God in the middle of everything. And maybe, just maybe, we can trust God too. Let's pray. God of love, in good times and bad, remind us that you are near. Help us to hear your voice, to know your way, and to see the good in all things. Be with us, calm us, and lead us forward, now and always. Amen.